Hello everyone and welcome to a new video. Today the Rainbow Festival is back for another year so we're going to be taking a look around, doing a few quests, having a look at the new tack and just exploring. We're not going to be doing absolutely everything, I'm just going to take a look and see what the Rainbow Festival has to give. Um, you have to excuse my voice, I'm a little bit sick at the moment. I'm just excited to do this um, new Rainbow Festival. I've not played the game for a couple of years, um, but I've recently got back into the game the last few months. So I'm excited to see what the Rainbow Festival looks like now compared to a few years ago. So let's let's get going. So the quests start in Moorland. Uh, so let's head over there and get started. Okay, here we are. And I believe Pico is over here. Okay, here's Pico the frog. <laughs> With his little hat on. Okay, so I haven't done any Rainbow Festival quests in a long time since I took a break from Star Stable. But we're back again now and we're going to do these quests. So I'm not going to read through it, read through it uh, with me and uh, we'll just get on with the quests. Help this little explorer find his owner. I recognise this little guy. Okay, it's Pico. Of course it's Pico. Please return me to Mika's hot air balloon. Close the door, was that me? Oh, this is really nice. Rainbow Festival is a lot different to what I remember um, since coming back and playing, but this is really sweet. Really colourful, really bright. I like it. Okay, so we're here at Mika's Hot Air Balloon. Here's Mika. Okay. Oh, okay. So we're travelling to the Zenith Base Camp in the clouds. Let's have a go. Let's see. Don't get excited, this is so much more different to... Oh! <laughs> well, um, okay. I've definitely never seen it in black and white before, so it's completely new. Let's try and find... Okay. Have fun in the clouds, brave explorer, and be careful where you step, it's a long way down. Okay. So let's talk to her about the Cloud Kingdom. Oh, it is really sad, isn't it? It's all dark and gloomy. There has to be something we can do to restore the colour. I mean, it's not like we can just go to the paint store. We should try to fix it, don't you agree, Kira? I definitely agree. It's looking very dark and dull. The fate of the Cloud Kingdom is up to us. Do you imagine there is any way we could use it to restore the Kingdom's colour? I hope so. Okay. Perhaps you want to take a closer look? Sure. A look. Right where well, here it is. Looks magical. Should I pick it up? Check out the strange object. I am getting so much horse XP from this, and I bought a horse that is maxed. Oh, that's so annoying. Okay. Whoa, what is happening? What is happening? Okay, a little bit of colour. Okay. So we've got a little bit of colour here, you can see on the other players, we've got a little bit of the yellow, a bit of yellow coming in, which is nice, okay. Let me know when you found more of the rainbow fragments so we can restore more colours. You can bring them back to me one by one, or all at the same time. Okay. Good luck, the Cloud Kingdom is counted on you. Okie dokie. What I am going to do quickly is go back to my home stable and change my horse so I can actually get some XP out of this. So I will be back in just two seconds. Okay, so we're back in one of my Jorvik Frisians, um, a low level one, so hopefully I can get a little bit of horse XP. Okay, follow the music notes to the source of the bizarre weather. We'll unlock all these quests first and then we'll go have a look around. That is all the quests from Mika. Let's start by having a look around. See what is going on. There's something just here. Let's go and collect some around here. And while we're collecting them, we'll have a look around, see if we can find any fragments or any of Mika's missing equipment. Oh, I've missed this. I've not done the Roman Festival in years. It's so nice to finally be back in the game. I can see something down here. Oh. 
well that's great um something just here because that's what i make this equipment maybe a telescope up here it's like a shovel Uh huh. Found a rainbow fragment here. Here's a rainbow fragment to take to Mika. Why am I? Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh. Well. No! Oh. There is a rainbow fragment sat here waiting for us. Okay, so we just travel back from the base camp and we move back the music notes. Okay, here we are. Wow. That's a little really out for themselves. Look at how amazing that character model is. If I ask like anything like that, it would be absolutely amazing. You're killing the vibe, yeah. Yep, I like that. <laughs> Fix the weather, okay. You fix this weather, Kira. If you want some shine back, you can go ahead and try and destroy my ice shards. Okay. Find you in this time. I find you socialising, have an amazing time trying to figure out your insignificant problems. I'm out. Oh, and for that, we've unlocked a new rainbow fragment. Okay. Let's go back and take this up to Mika. Okay. Okay, the last thing to check out is the new tax set and what the store offers. I'll be buying quite a few things from here. Um, not everything though, because looking at the prices of some of these things, um, I'm a little bit unsure. Um, I haven't unlocked all the colours yet. That's why you can't see everything in the full colour that they are. But yeah, I'm going to buy some things anyway um, and I can have a look at them afterwards. So just bear with me while I go through it and buy a few things. So I've just spent maybe 300, 400 star coins on all of these items here. Now don't get me wrong, they're all really joyful, really bright, really colourful. But I do wish uh, Star Stable made them a little bit cheaper. Because say this saddle pad here cost 80 star coins, which is nearly 
one week's worth of uh, weekly star coins that we get. So yeah, um, I just wish, oh, <laughs> they're a little bit cheaper, but otherwise they look really, really nice. So I'm happy. Okay, so that wraps up. Okay, so that just about wraps up the video. Um, I didn't have a look at everything that the Rainbow Festival has to offer, but I had a look at most things and I'm really happy with how it looks um, in comparison to a good few years ago when I used to play. Um, I hope you did enjoy the video uh, despite me falling off of clouds and running into clouds and all sorts of business. Uh, but thank you so much for watching and I'll hopefully I'll see you in the next video.